I know why you clicked on this video and you read that title right. I got a $500 perfume oil for free. <laughs> for free. Listen, listen. I'll, I don't... I, I don't even know. It was God's plan, okay? <laughs> it was God's plan. They wanted me to have this, okay? And it was not my intentions, but this is what had happened. So I'm going to just break down this whole story. Follow along if you want to. But if you're new here, hey, I'm Chi Chi and I talk about all things lavish, but logical and free at this point. <laughs> so... <laughs> Forgot my damn intro. So if that's your sort of thing, go ahead, subscribe, make some friends in the comment section and follow me on Instagram and TikTok. Okay, I'm gonna start off by saying I purchased this oil with my own money, okay? But we're going back this train up, okay? So I first heard about this from the Perfume Princess, right? And she was saying like, this was the most amazing decadent vanilla that she has ever smelled. So I was like, okay, I trust sis over there. Cause I already know she'd be smelling good. And there have been things that I've purchased because of her and I really, really enjoyed it. So I, I took her face value. Now, when she first talked about it, I saw the price and I was like, ooh, <laughs> miss me with that. And I was like, mm -mm, the, she can love it enough for the both of us, okay? I always store things in the back of my head, right? So I was scrolling, 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 surfing on the Saks Off Fifth website. And I pull it up and it's like, new in, I'm wash, vanilla barca. And I was like, hold on, is that the same oil that she was talking about? I said, ooh, ooh, okay. So I ended up purchasing it. Right, so this is Amwaj Vanilla Barca. This is a highly concentrated vanilla perfume oil. And it is in a, a tar. Now a tar is, I guess it's just like a dropper situation. I wasn't gonna buy it, but Saks Off Fifth had 40% off of the original price. I was like, all right, cool. And then of course, if you know, I know, you know, I know. I'm gonna throw on a disguise. I'm gonna set me up a new email account, okay? <laughs> so if you were new, you got an extra 10% off. So now, number one, which is crazy, I blind bought it. Something this expensive, I have never smelled before in my entire life. So that was already dumb wild. On top of the expensive nature of this product for it to come in this tiny, tiny, tiny bottle. So this is 12 mLs of fragrance oil. This is what I got. I'm fucking crazy. <laughs> yes, this is the bottle. This teeny, 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 tiny bottle. So basically, you're not supposed to use it a lot, okay? You're supposed to take it out. You're supposed to let it form. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show it in real time, all right? So you're supposed to take it and you're supposed to let the oil form into a drop. And that's all you're supposed to use. You're supposed to use that little drop. This, hold on, let me get my phone for the notes. This has vanilla, tonka bean, and olibanum. I hate saying that word, but apparently olibanum smells like frank frankincense. So it's kind of incense-y. I get this fragrance and I try it on my skin. I do exactly what I was told, you know, I get a little, throw a little on there. I'm, I'm done. I try to spread the wealth. And this is 1000% of incense vanilla. And I'm like, all right, okay. My, the vanillas I typically gravitate towards aren't your basic yummy type of vanillas. So I'm sitting, I'm sitting, I'm like, mm, I don't know if this is really my vibe. But after maybe 20 minutes, 
this vanilla starts pumping. And I was like, oh, now I see what she was talking about with that being like super yummy and delectable vanilla. It's definitely giving more of a vanilla pod, vanilla bean situation, but probably the most expensive French vanilla or Madagascan or I don't know what's the most popular vanilla child, you pick one. But it is very, very intensey on my skin. How did I get this for the free, right? So as I was putting this cap back into it, it's like a plunger system. So it has a rubber neck inside. So as I was pushing the top back into it on top, the whole entire rubber neck falls into the oil. The way I gasped, I was like, oh my God, what the hell? I can't get it out. It's a tiny hole. How am I supposed to do this? So I'm trying to get it out, trying to get it out. I can't get it out. And I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm losing oil at this point because every time I'm trying to get it out, it slips. I'm like, I'm not wasting this expensive oil. So I immediately contact Saxoff Fifth, I do a little chatty chat. And I'm like, hey, I just purchased this fragrance oil. The neck fell in. So they're like, oh, send pictures. I'm like, I'm, I'm right on top of that rose. So I send pictures and the rubber neck is just floating in, in the oil. I'm like, oh Lord, now it's done contaminated. My expensive oil. So with Saks Off Fifth, you can't do exchanges because it's almost like a first come first serve situation. And they were telling me we can um, refund you and you can just repurchase it. That's the only thing that they can do to you know, mediate the situation. So I'm like, all right, fine. Now remember, I have, I have bought this with a new 10% new customer thing. So I was like, okay, well, do I lose out on my discount because now I don't have that discount code, I've already used it. And they're like, once you're refunded, you can uh, hit us back up and you know, set it up, we'll give you a new code so you don't miss out on it. And I'm like, all right, cool, 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 cool. I was like, all right, so uh, you can just send me the shipping label and I can try to, I don't know how I'm gonna do this, but you know, I'm gonna send it back to you. They were like, don't worry about it. You can just throw it out. Bitch, what? <laughs> throw what out? F throw what out? Ma'am, did you not hear me say this thing is $500? I'm not throwing out this damn child the way I bolted to get me some thin tweezers. I took the neck out. <laughs> This is the stopper that was in the bottle. Now, I done wasted about $30 worth, <laughs> it's not really $30, but I wasted a lot of oil trying to fish this out of this bottle and I had to keep it just as a reminder to self. But I was just like, I cannot believe this, this lady said, just throw it out. I don't even know if it was a lady or a man because it was just, through uh, the chatty chat chat. But I was like, are you kidding me? Like, I'm not throwing this damn oil out and I'm not gonna block my blessings because I was like, okay, well I could just buy a new one, you know? But I was, then I started thinking, I'm like, what if the same thing happens again? And I try to put it back in and the thing falls in again. And I'm like, I'm not trying to do it. And I actually got the thing out try to reposition it. Cause you know, I'm a good hearted person. I tried my best, okay? I put it back to where it was and put the thing back on and it fell right into it again. And I was like, why even do that to myself? Like, why? Why, Ebony? Why? I was like, you know what? I'm not going to block my blessings. God wanted me to have this expensive behind perfume for the free. Okay. And then I could have been like a scammer and like bought another one and did the same thing and they might have did the same thing but i was like you know what i'm not gonna be greedy i'm not gonna be greedy i'm not gonna no i'm gonna take my win 
and keep it pushing. Essentially, I got my refund and I got to keep the oil, which is wild, which is wild. Now I was covered in this scent for two days because I'm not going to waste whatever oil was on here. When I tell you that thing was sticking on me, <laughs> it was sticking on me. Let's talk about the fragrance now. I don't feel like the fragrance itself is a huge projector, but it lasts hella long on the skin. It's incredible how long this just is on my skin. It's like wild. I was like, oh, okay. But for this price, you would think that tons of people would be able to smell it, you know, just by the little little bit of sauce that I put on. Now, I mean, ugh, I like it. Oh, it's, it's that vanilla is starting to kick in. This little bottle will be cherished. Now, I'm not gonna keep it in this bottle. I'm probably going to go to Amazon and get, you know, a cute little perfume bottle um, and put the oil into uh, said bottle because now it doesn't have that stopper, so it's not preserving the the fragrance, you know. And I'm not I'm not trying to go through this this bottle. This ain't gonna be something that I'm like, ooh, you can rub it all everywhere. First of all, you don't need that much because when I did have all of it on, trying to like not waste it, it triggered a headache. Okay, a migraine actually. So it is potent, very, very potent. I really don't want to transfer it out of this bottle because there is something so luxurious about taking this by the dropper and just a little here, a little here. How fabulous did I just look? It is nice once that like frankincense kind of like settles down in that vanilla. Oh, when the vanilla shows up, she shines, okay? This is probably the wildest <laughs> thing that has happened as far as fragrance goes. And I've just been so nervous to keep it up here. I'm like, oh my God, what if a, a bottle falls or, you know, it knocks over before I can get my new uh, bottle. Oh, damn, damn. This does smell really, really nice though. Uh, only little bits. So this I'm going to reserve, like, first of all, when I wear vanilla fragrances or something with a little bit more bra in the vanilla, something with some leather in it, something with frankincense in it, something more incense -y, you know, any sort of vanilla like that. I don't even have to wear it with vanilla. I, I honestly want to try it with Delina Exclusive. I feel like this would be a fabulous combination of epic proportion. <laughs> I think it would be. But, yo, I got a $500 fucking fragrance oil. Damn, like, big bull. Like, to the people who actually do buy this regularly, like, kudos to you. But, um... I can see why it was on, you know, Saxaw Fifth. Bot the bottle's a little faulty, but I got to participate and partake in it. I remember I, I called my mom and everything. First of all, she was probably like, girl, why'd you spend that much? You spent how much on what? I ain't never showed her the bottles. She gonna see this video and she gonna be like, Chris, doll. She gonna use my government name, yep. I'm gonna be like, yes. <laughs> But all's well that ends well, right? I mean, we came up, baby. Like they said, 2024 was my year. So <laughs> this is the first of good things to come. <laughs> but in the meantime, check out some of my other videos and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys.